coming. Here it is. Up around the face. His approach to the plate right here has to be to the right side. If he gets it through the infield, that tying run might come around, but at the very least, that would get the runner to third with less than two outs. Hit sharply toward the right side. That's in there. Base hit. Now a long throw home. And they'll get it in quickly. It's first and third now with nobody out. I mean, you want to talk about doing your job and getting paid for it. There it is right there. Unselfish A.B. trying to work his guy from second to third. And oh, what do you know? Not for yourself. Now time is asked for at home plate and granted by the umpire back there, Earl Hendricks. Stepping in now, Kevin Pillar. As the changeup to him drops in there for the first strike. And they're runners at the corners now. The 0 1. Way out in front. You know, you don't face too many guys that have thrown a nasty splitter like he has today. He's had this lineup off balance all game with that pitch. And this one gets away. A throw to the plate, and not in time as the run scores. And would you believe the tying run?
comes in to score on a wild pitch. Man, oh man. The one two. Line towards center field. Dives and he hangs on for the out. Wow. And he'll make it up to third safely here with one away. The batter, number seven. Shortstop. Gray. Speedy Trey Turner digs in now. And he'll quickly send a line drive to center field. But unfortunately, right at the shortstop for the second out. Up next for the Blue Jays, the designated hitter. The plate now is the designated hitter, Jose Abreu. It's been an 0 for 2 effort for him to this point. Hoping to keep it tied, here it comes. Ball and a strike now to Jose Abreu. One, one. He's set. Here comes the 1 1. Missed with a slider. 2 and 1. And maybe trying to get him off stride at the plate so he'll step out and ask for time. Now this is driven out to deep right center. This could be trouble. And trouble it is. It's down for extra bases. And that'll bring in the go-ahead run from third. It's now a 4-3 to three game. And he is in there with an RBI triple. So close yet so far away. Two outs but back-to-back -back hits. This one a triple. And three runs have now been chased home. We'll see if the defense can make a play and get them out of this nightmare. And a fastball there is inside as that one backed him up a bit. He went deep earlier, so that might have been a little bit of a message they were trying to send to get him off the plate. At the very least, they're clearly trying to get him from getting his arms extended again. Looking to keep this a one-run game, the pitch. And I believe they'll say he broke the plane as, yes, he did. It's ruled a strike. One one home slap hard the opposite way and a base hit and that'll get the run in from third outside of taking a ball in the seats Dan these were my favorite knocks to get two outs man on third and you're able to upset that entire team including that pitcher with a late two out ready now and so frustrating from a pitcher standpoint hero you kind of you're in trouble you're one pitch away from getting out of some trouble make one bad pitch a base hit the inning continues and another run batted in here's the 1 0 chop foul right by home plate and it's a ball and a strike the 1 1 pitch is looked at for ball number two well I think he just kind of lost focused on the mound right there it's clearly not going his way and He's thinking more about that than the task at hand. And right now he needs to think about this hitter. A swing and this one is blasted to right field. Nothing's going to stop it. Into the bleachers and gone. A two run blast to straight away right field. Home run number three here in the early going as it is now seven to three. I think if this pitch would have been a little higher and in on his hands, it would have been effective. But he left this one belt high. Big mistake. He's a guy that will feast on belt high pitches on the inner half, which is pretty obvious. Miguel Castro will come on and make his fourth appearance in this campaign. Standing in now, JT Real Muto, as he takes a cold strike at the knees, it's 0-1. He's 0 for 2 in the ballgame so far. Into the windup, here comes the 0 and 1. 
in front of the change up there as this is chopped foul at home plate. The wind up and the 0 2 pitch. Swing and a soft liner. That gets down and he's got himself a base hit. Two out success means Randall Grichick will bat this inning. Man, he got the front foot down right there, kept the front shoulder up, and was able to stay inside that ball for a soft liner in the center. From the stretch, here's the pitch. Takes a good swing, but this will be a foul ball. And he watches one dip low and inside for a ball, one and one. The one one home. Little flare out to left. In there, a base hit. Hey, pitchers, you better start taking notice of this guy. He better be circled on that lineup card because he's on fire. That's his second hit of the ball game right there, and I don't see him stop. So that'll bring in Teoscar Hernandez. As the first pitch misses to him, it's ball one. Two hits and two trips for him thus far. Swing and a miss on the sinker, a ball and a strike. He's going to need to shorten up and get that foot down a little bit earlier if he hopes to be catching up to that fastball. Popped him up. Davis ranging into the outfield, and that's the third out. 